Hello, I'm Amir Fazal and what are lambda expressions in Python? Lambda expressions are used to create functions. Uh, let's do it. Open up Python, open up a terminal so that we can open open up Python. So open up terminal then uh, open up Python. We are going to create um, functions using lambda expressions. Uh, we can create functions something called anonymous functions. Anonymous mean, means unnamed functions. Uh, so say square equals then the lambda expression and lambda's number colon number multiplied by number and type square and it says function it's class function it's a function object wow so it is a function square 5 and it returns 25 square 3 9 because number multiplied by number is the square of that number right squared so square 10 and we get 100 so 10 squared is 100 and just say square and see there is a description about that object function lambda because um, lambda expressions we can create functions using lambda expressions that's why and we associated the uh, the object to the to the key to the identifier square the name square now say pluralize equals lambda the argument word colon word plus s and type pluralize it's a function just like the square function this is a function that we have created so user defined function pluralize ball and what is the plural of ball balls pluralize a uh, boy and it's boys pluralize a cup and it's cups concatenation we can use the addition the plus operator the the plus symbol for both arithmetic addition and as well as string concatenation. So pluralize function and, and C pluralize is a function without the brackets, without the parentheses. That's how we call a function, right? So write a function add equals lambda num1 num2 both two parameters num1 plus num2 that's the function body here, the expression. So type add it's a function add 10 comma 3 and we get 13 add 1000 comma 300,000 and the answer is 300,000 uh, thousand <laughs> add 34.2 comma 23.523 and the answer is 57.723 a decimal uh, a floating point number so let's make the same function uh, functions with the def keyword we used lambda keyword for the above examples now use the uh, def keyword def the normal way of making functions or procedures so def square two number colon return statement number multiplied by number the, the function body number multiplied by number part is the same but there is a return keyword here earlier no return keyword right so square two three and it's nine square three uh, 9 so notice that square 2 is the new function square is the lambda function function that we created we have created earlier so square the, the answers are same for both of these functions type square 2 and it says function type square it says fun function once you have created the function it is the same kind of object okay that's why class function everything in Python is an object so something called object so that's why if even functions are actually objects let's create pluralize function uh, def pluralize 2 I have chosen square 2 and pluralize 2 because square and pluralize names were are already taken for lambda function functions <laughs> okay pluralize 2 word return word plus s pluralize girl girls pluralize to girl and it's girls so again we can see the same kind of function behavior um, the processes are working the same way uh, um, for both kind both functions so yeah and uh, pluralize just pluralize and we can see the description pluralize to we can see the description I'm doing it uh, the same thing over and over again just to show you that both 
way of making functions at the end these are functions maybe something like that <laughs> so and let's let's compare the now now let's compare both the functions uh, functions created with def keyword and def square number return number multiplied by number functions created with lambda keyword square equals lambda number colon number multiplied by number so with this def keyword uh, there is a return statement and indentation is important but lambda functions are small and it is a one line function it's kind of like a one liner so def pluralize word return word plus s there is this indentation rule you should follow and uh, the lambda expression the version is just one line so thanks for watching this video and share this video please subscribe to my channel and click on that bell icon so that you get notifications when from whenever when i make it when i upload a video and other notifications so uh, thanks guys thank you